thinking about it, and it's been a long day. So today I'm headed over to Vice headquarters. Vice initially started here in Montreal. And so I'm gonna go up there and see if I can try to get a job with them. You know, I think Vice would be a great company to work for. And uh, since I'm already here in Montreal, like why not take a chance, you know? I guess it's uh, Shoot Your Shot Tuesday. So I guess we're gonna find out if they have any positions available and uh, we'll see what's up. So I'll see you guys in a bit. See the lovely top change, that's only cause Jackie let me go and whip a mom's range Hey, hey, many spots when I step in the villa like Cruella DeVille, she look crooked as hell That girlfriend get face, k k kinda like what we do to a L I'm real, I'm real, uh Good sex and foot cramps like, look man, we just shook hands But I'm racing to that top, so I took chances I look back and now ain't that real So most of the work is in French Most of the writing they do is in French, so... But he told me to bring my resume up here and see if uh, he could potentially fit me somewhere. So we're gonna go do that and uh, see what happens. Trade that strong haze and my aunt say that I gotta make it for her. It's been a long day. I'm um, long day. I'm um, long day. Stuck thinking about it. People always get discouraged, you know, whenever they get a no. But you gotta keep trying, man. Regardless of what it is, man. Don't get discouraged. Keep going. Keep fighting for what you want. Because at the end of the day, like the only person who's gonna fight for your dream is you. So if you're not fighting for it, then who is? Stuck thinking about it, and it's been a long day. Stuck thinking about it, driving on the freeway. Uh, is that some, somebody's playing? Uh, what's that Slim Shady song called? The uh, but that was on it, huh? But that was on it, huh? Damn, I'm getting kind of swole again. Putting in work. Jesus. Yo, what's up? So on Tuesday, I think, I went over to Vice to try to see if I can get a job with them or just land anything. I was telling my friends, I was like, man, if I, I would mop the floors if I have to just to say that I work with Vice because for a lot of people who don't know who Vice is, Vice is a media company and they uh, mainly focus on worldwide issues. Normally, stories that you don't see in the news very often, they represent a lot of the values that I truly care for myself. So I just, I wanted to take a shot. So I went over there, I was expecting this massive headquarters and it was like this little office space with maybe like six people working there. And I was like, man, like this is crazy. I thought Vice was a giant, massive media company. I spoke to one of the guys there and he was, I mean, first things first, like uh, most of the media content comes out in French. So there's not really a place for me there. But one thing he did say to me was uh, just to go ahead and, and bring in my resume and maybe he could send it off to somebody. Cause they got offices in, in, in Toronto, they got offices in Brooklyn and Los Angeles, I think. So, I mean, you never know. The thing is just to give it a chance, man. Give it a shot, man. See what happens, you know? Cause at the end of the day, like you never know who you might meet, who might know somebody who knows somebody, you know? So sometimes you just gotta take a shot, man. Regardless if, if you get rejected, regardless if they say no, like you just gotta do it, man. Cause I feel like a lot of the times we get discouraged when somebody tells us no and it kinda, like everything that we're working towards kind of stops. You got to keep fighting and pushing through it regardless of what happens, regardless of how many rejection letters. Like I can't even begin to express how many times I've been rejected throughout my, you know, time that I've spent chasing this passion of mine. So it's like, you can't get discouraged. If you're not fighting for your own dream, then who's going to fight for you? So just keep chasing, doing what you do. But that's pretty much it for me. Um, Thank you so much for watching, you guys. Like, I've been receiving so much feedback, so much positive feedback these last couple of weeks. And it's very, very encouraging, you know. But obviously, it takes a lot of time. I put in a lot of effort into this because it really means a lot to me, you know. So, thank you for watching. And I'll probably catch you guys on Friday, I hope. Um, but, yeah. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe. And uh, peace out. If you didn't catch last week's video, I'll be sure to post it right here.